Hi everyone, in this video we take a look at Jabali uh, in the game Concord. Uh, he is a support hero in the game, and basically a healer. Uh, but he has uh, some nice uh, damage as well, but again don't expect of course more than that. Basically the cool thing about him is that you can create a healing aura around an ally when it's absorbed or around you. Uh, this is very very useful when you are surrounded with your allies. Aside from that, he has an offensive orb, which you can just throw. Great for eliminating basically uh, uh, squishy characters, though low health HP characters. Now, the reason you want to use your uh, secondary uh, ability is because it helps you. Now, the reason you want to use your second ability, the Hunter Orb, when you hit or eliminate an enemy, because it charges your life pulse, so you can use it more often. Also, a triple jump to easily get to high elevation areas and evading enemies. And let's look at the gameplay so you can see how it plays. To be honest with you, I personally prefer Doe, although again, because you can actually heal while moving, that's actually very, very useful. But keep in mind, you need to be with your team if they play separately in some game modes. It's going to be a situation where teams, everybody's spread up. You won't be useful, so better choose another hero. But if you kind of uh, team up with somebody or play with a friend, some, something like that, you can easily support them very well. 
uh, with your healing ability and kind of a deal initial damage or you know the final damage where enemies try to run away without needing to be super accurate. Your weapon is also has uh, less recoil, so less likely to miss. You can shoot lots of bullets, also so you can put some suppressive damage. Overall, a solid character. Not that I think that it's uh, something like OP or something in terms of his abilities. Yes, uh, good. I mean, I mean, I can compare it to Doe, for example. The Doe do have a stationary uh, healing still with the ability to block completely projectiles. We are kind of crazy in this game. Uh, and in insane damage, much more damage with his weapon as well. Uh, again, for mid-range uh, positioning and being behind your team and healing them. And there's so many choke points here as well. But again, it doesn't, though doesn't have a kind of a fast suppressive damage, especially when there are many enemies, you want to quickly kind of deal damage and prevent them from getting in. They are close together. Overall, each one has their own advantages. And that's it for this video. Let me know what you think about this hero. See you on the next guide. Cheers.